hey what's up y'all welcome back to my channel so this is part two of how to make a simple youtube intro so yeah let's get it all right y'all so here is just where i'm just trying to figure out what i'm trying to do this is the second part of how to make a youtube intro so this is just a video i might be using so i'm just about to trim it down and find out what parts that I like that I'm going to be using so I'm just doing that and yeah y'all watching me rock my hips the way hey look at it yeah that's that tiktok tiktok moves we get in Okay, y'all, so I'm still out here trying to figure out what I'm doing. So I'm just mixing and matching things, finding out the right sizes, trying to figure out what I'm going to do, what orders I'm going to put the videos in. So that's what I'm doing. So I just be erasing stuff, putting it back, erasing stuff, and putting it back. So, yeah, I'm just figuring out what I want to do. So I'm getting the videos now. Um evening them out so i have them all on the same thing so if you watch part one of the video you know how to get the background as well as you know how to add pictures on the overlay so that's what we're doing you also should already know how to lighten down the video using your opacity which is what i'm doing but now i'm going into the fonto app and i'm starting to do my text because the cape cup app the cape cut app does not have a lot of font options and i don't really feel like downloading any so i try to take the short way out y'all and just try to copy and paste all it is like screenshot it and then put it in the super x um impressions app and do all of that out like that but i just end up going back and just typing each one of them out individually as y'all can see i have vlog business and lifestyle i did that in the font and the style and the color that i wanted i saved it to the phone and now i went back into the super x app and i just went and take out i went and took out all the unnecessary background that i don't need so that i can have my letters transparent the way that you have been seeing them because i like the transparent look so that's what we're going for a nice clean look so i'll let y'all watch that while I'll go ahead and yeah erase all of this out for and that is for the vlog business and lifestyle words that we end up creating and saving to our phone from the fonto app so yeah continue to watch and don't forget to subscribe to my channel
Okay, y'all, so I'm just about finishing up with getting all the background from off of my words. And now I'm going to go back into the K-Cup, make sure that my video is the way that I want it to be, how I want it to be. So I'm just going back in there and I'm just mixing and matching and things. And if just in case I did not mention, if you want to add any type of effects, on your videos as far as them sliding in moving in jumping in or anything like that you will click on the video that you would like to add that effect to and you will click on video effects or body effects and it will show you the different effects they have for your video so now i'm right here now right here i'm just going back in and i'm taking those words that i use vlogs business and lifestyle and i'm putting it towards the video so as you can see i just inputted the business one i'm putting the business one on there right after it fades out so yeah i'm gonna do that with the vlog section as well as the lifestyle section so yeah, just continue to watch and I'll be back when I'm on to the next step. Okay, y'all, so now that I have all my words put on the screen, we're almost at the end of the editing. So to add the words to the screen, you're just going to click on the video, whichever video you want, and then you're gonna click on add overlay. Once you add on overlay, it's gonna let you choose the images that you would like to use in the video. So that's what I did, as well as leave a comment down in the description box if you would like for me to show you how to do the YouTube subscribe button in your video, as well as doing your YouTube watermark that sits on all your YouTube videos. So let me know in the comment section. I'll be dropping a video for that soon. Just let me know. So y'all already know the first part, part one to the intro, that's already completed. I'm just going back over it, making sure everything looks the way I want it to look and everything like that. Y'all, this is just a super easy tutorial. You could do this in Cape Cut. Like it's not that long and it's free. So yeah, and y'all gonna see me go back out cause the Tory, the outline is white. So I had one that already had the correct outlining on there. So I just end up going back in just to show y'all how to do it in the Fonto in the Super X Zoom app. So now I'm just going back and I'm just clicking on that transparent image and I'm putting it wherever I like in the video. And I'm just reviewing the video just to make sure that, yeah, this is the intro that I want. So yeah we just trying to mix and match that y'all it's not hard at all to do this it's just time consuming meaning that you gotta maneuver through different apps maneuver through the internet your pictures and stuff like it's time consuming but to learn to learn this this is really easy anybody can learn how to make their own youtube intro if y'all would like me to make y'all youtube intro i don't mind doing it for free just to give me some work in so just leave your information down in the comment section and i'll reach out to you because i don't mind doing youtube videos or creating stuff i rather do it for free in my spare time because it's it's easy to do at this point but yeah we're just finishing up the video you guys and i want to thank you guys for watching, continue to watch, like, comment, and subscribe.